Look what I order from internet. This beautiful PCB board. And it says that it can handle 60 amperes. And what is it? It's a BMS. Battery Management System Board for Continuous Discharge Charge Power that can be used for electric drills with starting current below 120 amperes and below 260 watts. This board is for charging 3S batteries and it can be wired like this. And I got it. No bubbles. Oh. Come on. And what is beautiful about this PCB board? Beside that, one, two, three, ten MOSFETs for charging, discharging the lithium batteries. You have from the left side charge point and from the right side discharge, meaning you can charge and discharge at the same time with only one board. There are points for 0, 4.2 volts, 8.4 volts and 12.6 volts. Balance management system board for lithium batteries. 12.6 volts, revision 2.3, 60 amperes. This tiny board can handle 60 amperes and can be used, let's say, for drill that pull very much current. You can see on the photo the wiring diagram, how to connect the cells with the BMS board, and it's not too much complicated. I'm going to show you how to wire and solder all the wires to the lithium batteries. But before doing that, the sponsor of this video is JLC PCB. And you can design and order a beautiful PCBs just like this one. Okay, let's continue with the project. These are my cells, 18650 batteries. I have three pairs. Two 18650 are connected in parallel. So I will get four, eight, 12 volts and connected just like on the wiring diagram with the BMS Balanced Management System board. Let's connect now. So far so good. I assemble all the cells, place the, the board on top. And by the way, I didn't mention this kind of BMS board costs around one to two dollars. It's cheap. 
I'm going to make the connection from the board to the cells. Let's do that. Let's check the batteries before connect them with the wires. 4 volts, 4, the second one and the third one, also 4. Okay. I know that it is better to use a spot welder, but in this case I'm soldering a wires between the cells and I have already ordered a spot welder from online and very soon I will make a review video okay now the next one all three cells are connected in series and right now we'll, I will measure so I can see is there 12 volts positive this one is negative and yes I got 12 volts so far so good finish it with wiring all the wires between the board and the cells and just to solder wires for charge and discharge or load just to check the voltages here we have 4 volts 8 volts and 12 The battery pack with BMS board is finished. We have on these wires charge and discharge or load. Please be careful. You don't want to short it or any kind of bad things. The worst thing is explosion. Be careful. I'm going to put marks like here where it says charging and this is the discharging. And it's time for testing. And on purpose, the negative wire is short than the positive on the both sides, just for protection. Just to connect the positive wires to the drill. And the negative will go through the ampermeter of the multimeter. I need to use this multimeter because it, it can handle 20 amperes. Right. And let's try it. Yes, working fine. It's not pulling very much because this drill is 20 volts. I'm sending just a 12 volts and it's pulling only one amp. All right. Okay, here I have another drill. Let's try that. This one. Woo! Working fine and it's pulling 7 amperes. That was the maximum, I think. 8 amperes. Woo! I like it. And working great. This battery, battery pack turned out okay. Okay. Now I will show you that this battery pack with the balanced management system board is charging properly. S sending 12.6 volts from my power supply. The current is limited to 1.3 amperes. And it's charging. The first cell for 4.18 volts. The second we have 8.35 volts. And the third together 12.5 volts. Alright. Everything is okay. 
In this video I wanted just to show you how you can assemble and make your own battery pack. This one is 12 volts using a BMS board. I show you how to do it. Please give a like, share and subscribe to my channel. That was all for today's video. See ya!